Hey, how's it going guys? So today we're going to be doing firing range on chimps. So to get started, we're going to put a sub right in this top right, top left corner. <laughs> and now we're going to grab another sub during this round. Alright, so we got the sub. Now we're going to be saving up to get rid of this thing. <laughs> Alright, so the reason we want to get rid of this sentry post slash tower, whatever the heck it is, we want a good spot for Obin. So during the next round, we're going to put Obin down right in this corner, really, right here. Alright, so during round 14, we're going to be ready. We're going to turn it off fast forward, and we're going to put him there, and we're good. So. Next, we're going to be wanting to get a 202 sub, because he's good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Alright, so we got advanced intel, and we are going to grab twin guns right now. Alright. <laughs> so we got twin guns on that dude. So now, we're obviously, we're going to be saving up for your burst starts. So I have... I'm leaving in a couple days, and this video is going up the 7th, and I'm leaving the 8th. Um, so on this round, you're probably going to want to put one of those down, even though it gets used up like right away, but it helps. So airburst starts. Meant to grab that as soon as I could, but you know. Ooh. So scratch that. <laughs> well. Right at the start of that round, you're going to want to use uh, brambles. But you should actually probably put down this guy first. And, oops, instead of uh, getting air burst hearts. But. Oh, okay. But the brambles takes care of the camo. Just well. Just as well. <laughs> but yeah. Just <laughs> so be careful with that. So we're going to grab Intense Magic as well as Camo Detection. And then we're going to grab Arcane Mastery. Alright, so we have enough for Arcane Mastery, so that will definitely be helpful. And we're going to want to upgrade this guy to Airburst Starts as well. You know, Advanced Intel included. So yeah, basically I have to hurry up on <laughs> these videos, but... I'm not going to sacrifice, uh, you know, quality. Uh, if I have to miss a couple days, then that's fine. I don't want to put up shitty videos. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> so if I do miss a couple days, then that's why I was just unprepared. I haven't really felt very well lately, and it was just like, oh, I'll do it later, I'll do it later, and... I, I can't do it later now, <laughs> so, yeah. So, basically, we are going to save up for Arcane Spike at the moment. But I'm actually going to go ahead and place a dude right here with a sick mixture dip, and now we'll save up for Arcane Spike. So I'm going to use a Bramble for the Moab round just in case, but I don't really think I'll need it. But, might as well just in case. Sure. Yeah, I probably didn't need it. <laughs> Alright, so round 45, we can grab Arcane Spike. So that is nice. So I'm actually going to put two ninja sub... Or, ninja subs. <laughs> ninja monkeys. Over here. On these, because... If we save up for Archmage now, we're basically going to get it right, right at 63 or something like that. So 62 is kind of like scary <laughs> without these guys. So yeah, we're gonna want to get these both these guys to four zero twos. Doesn't exactly matter which way you do it in, which order you do it in. <laughs> Plus these guys give some extra range to the subs, so we can go and afford them. So that's awesome. So now we're just saving up for our Kamech at this point. Or actually, I'm gonna go ahead and place a village 
down. Let's we'll give him jungle drums. Should we give Oban camo? Maybe not yet. I'll hold off on that. So, I'll see you when we can afford our mage. <laughs> Alright, so for 63, we have our wall of trees down, although I don't think you really need it. But I could be mistaken, so I'd just put it down. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you, you, you don't need it. <laughs> they took care of it. Alright, so we're about to be able to afford Archmage. Boom. <laughs> there we go. Awesome. So, you know, with Oban, Oban's buff. Well, at level 2, you get plus 1 pierce, and 11, you get plus 5 range and plus 3 pierce. So, yeah, that's, I mean, really good for magic towers. So, yeah. I'm sure, like, pretty much everyone knows that, though. But, yeah. <laughs> so, right now, we're gonna go ahead and grab Berserker Brew and save up for a Stronger Simulant. And then we're gonna go ahead and save up for Perma Spike. So, Stronger Simulant. I guess we'll grab Acid Pool and Faster Throwing. Does Faster Throwing throw brews faster? I think it does. I've always thought it does, but maybe it doesn't. <laughs> I don't know. It says potions too, so oh, wait, I think that might mean just his regular attack. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Oh well. So now begins the save for Perma Spike. So I'm gonna give him his own his own uh, alchemist, so that way he always has the acidic mixture dip on that way he can pop DDTs so yeah we'll be back once we can afford it all right so we are back and we can afford permaspike awesome so we'll go ahead and grab a 402 alchemist now <laughs> and we already got the jungle drums up so obviously don't have to worry about that but I think we will go for an overclocker now, next. So, yeah. I don't do that very often, but we'll just keep this guy overclocked. Should be uh, completely fine. I've been trying to be a little more energetic, but it just doesn't work. Like, I don't know. Like, I would definitely be able to be more energetic if I was playing, like, first person game or something like that that was actually like really interesting but blooms you're just kind of like you put towers down and then you just sit there and watch it's not exactly exciting i guess like it's a fun game but it's it doesn't bring out emotions you know if you get what i mean i don't know and i'm not good at faking things so i can't exactly fake it either <laughs> So, uh, it's like, I mean, I, I don't want to be a faker, but, like, I should be a little more energetic. Definitely not over the top, but, oh, uh, God, I don't know. I just struggled. <laughs> I struggled. All right, so we got overclock. Probably don't really need to worry about using it on these rounds, because these rounds are not very bad, but I might as well just use them. Might as well, might as well. Our wall of wall of trees, it's more like wall of tentacles with this skin, but you know, <laughs> is soaking up some balloons, so that is scary. <laughs> Alright, so 95, this is another round where that ninjas come in handy but yeah all right so ddt's ddt galore good oh yeah i forgot to mention we got these that this guy upgraded so i guess at this point i'll just place some more arcane spike dudes oh you know what we could we could give oban uh camo detection i i guess that'll help I, I, I don't know why I upgraded that, but, you know. <laughs> Alright, we can put another wall of trees down. Or tentacles. 
All right, all righty then. Uh, okay, I can't fit in then. The temple's range, village's range. I don't know why I said temple. Anyway, we'll keep overclocking this dude. And yeah, I don't think I'll be able to afford another arcane spike by the time 100 rolls around. But I guess we'll see. I guess we shall see. All right, 98. Probably the hardest round. Maybe. Yeah, I mean, it's either 98 or 100 that's the hardest. I'd honestly say 98. Unless you have, like, Benjamin. Benjamin totally cripples this round. We are starting to... I'm going to put Wall of Trees back up. We ran a bit low on there, on uh, perma spikes. We also could afford one of those guys easily. <laughs> yeah, I actually didn't expect that. But we put brambles up, even though it's really not going to do that much. But <laughs> we need all the help we can get. No, no, we don't. Not really. <laughs> not on this run, at least. We'll easily be able to take care of it. So yeah, well. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe if you like the video. And have a great day. <laughs> Bye. That's it?